Hi, in this uh, video we are going to be looking at the broadcast messages for email and mobile. So the first one, let's uh, go to it. Add a broadcast message. This is going to be an email and we're going to send it out in plain text. Uh, so we're just going to make a subject here. Hi Ron. Um, get immediate access to did, did, did. bit of curiosity never, never heard and in the body of the message see we're not using HTML maybe we'll just do this the team now, I've actually set a delay in here to coincide with VPSs and shared service. Uh, the hosts don't like more than 500 emails being sent every hour uh, because of hogging of resources. So I put a, um, an 8 second delay in between all the messages. So uh, when I click on send, there will be an 8 second uh, delay before the message gets sent and as it says here please do not close your browser window so you can imagine when you get up into the 500 and thousands you would probably pay you to go onto a dedicated server so you didn't have to worry about having this uh, delay in there now it says number of emails sent is two but it's uh, because it's recognized two emails in there but it's only sent to one as it says there because it's the valid email address that it's actually sent it to. So let's open up the browser here a bit. Go into inbox. One new social no that's not it. Go into updates. Oh there it is. Took a bit longer than to arrive. So there we go. Click on there. Top spot. Yada yada ying bang. That's good. There's your middle message. There's your bottom message. Note we've got the PHP tags coming through uh, because I sent this message in as text and this is HTML uh, and you'll see down here this is correct so uh, this is something else I put into the autoresponder as well the availability of being able to change your email address and mobile phone okay so if I wanted to change that to 30 click on change email and it says that it's successfully changed so that's good but you don't want to leave it, leave it on there because I don't know whose number that is. So we'll change it back to mine. Honky Dory. Go back into here. Uh, and what I'm going to do now is I'm going to say, send the same message but as HTML. So you can see that you will need to go into your uh, bottom ad and change it to text if you're going to be sending your emails by text or it's okay if it's um, leave it as is if you're going to send it by HTML out there we are one new one right so now when I click on here nothing's changed up here this is your top spot ad this is where your normal message goes but you can see now that I've sent it in uh, HTML there's no HTML tags there and when you come down here you'll see that the unsubscribe is now as a link HTML link um, I will see if I can work on this one here but it's uh, it'll take a bit of bit of coding to work out how to change this one because it's just the way I've set things up so it's, it's not a major um, I'll work on it and put that through as an update at a later date okay so there you go there's your uh, sending out your broadcast for email now we will go into mobile list the mobile go in here add a broadcast now you can see this is slightly different to the mobile one as well so this is going to be uh, mobile test But anyway, so hi Ron. Mobile test 
the team. And this gets sent uh, to, straight away. So put the old phone up here. And there you go. I've now received the text. So I'm going to open up my phone, which you won't be able to see. But it says, Hi Ron, mobile test. Uh, the team tap to unsubscribe. Now, looking at the format on my phone, what we need to do is also put another space in underneath there so that the uh, tap to unsubscribe uh, is not on the same line as the team. And then I'm going to send it again, just because I can. And that's far better, much better. -er. Okay, so that's uh, sending your mobile broadcasts. Okay, um, you can go in there and you can see what was sent at any particular time. Uh, but with the viewing, you cannot resend that message. Um, you've got to go in and create a brand a new one. Okay, so. Later on, I will uh, create, do a advanced uh, video, which will show you how to actually uh, um, combine the mobile and the email drip messages. So some are sent out by uh, email, and any that you consider really, really important, we can set up to send out by text. Okay. Well, thank you very much for watching all these videos, and if you have any. Uh, challenges then you can refer to the help here uh, which will have all these videos stored in this section here uh, failing that just get hold of our support desk and uh, we will answer it as quickly as we can for you in the meantime thank you very much for listening and uh, this is Ron Pumphrey catch you later